50% range of motion and counting. Well, your therapy has gone so well. I bet you'll be going home pretty soon. <laughs> yeah. Maybe a house doesn't make it a home. Lucy. If you forget anything, you know I can make no, sure and send it. Good. You know I, I should make you a snack or something to take with you. Can... I don't drag this out any. Uh, I just I, I got to do a couple of things and then then I'm leaving. I just got to find the courage to do two things and then I'm. Gone. What are the two things? Well, I have to say goodbye to my son. And I have to say goodbye to you. Oh, man. See, I don't know what's going on anymore. Baby, 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 baby. Look, look into my eyes. I'm real. Look, touch me. It's cool. Go ahead. Now, don't tell me that didn't feel any different from when you were putting your, your hands on that fantasy girl. So I dreamed her up? And I am here to set you straight. You gotta let go. You gotta let go this time for good or else it's just gonna bring you down, Ricky. Hey, that's what you got for me. I'll be back in a minute. Hey, <laughs> Libby. Mm. Look who it is, the jerk well, from the other night. What's your name again? I forget. Is it John? No, no Joe. Jerk. Uh, no, it's Jack. Hi. Hi. The same jerk who you wished would not hate you anymore. The same jerk who made me think he was falling in love with me again. Oh, come on, Liv. You got to admit it was a good joke. It was a bad huh? joke, Jack. Bad. I don't hate you for saying that. I don't. No, thanks. So, uh, would you like a drink? Chardonnay. So I'm guessing that uh, you are upset because of Caleb. Just a guess. Not everything that makes me upset has to do with Caleb. So um, the other night, you uh, after you left me, you went back to Caleb. How do you know uh, where I went? Because I know you, and it would be my guess that you tried to put the moves on him, and he didn't bite. Story of my life. Right. And now you're here. Your old buddy Jack, wanting his advice. Well, let me give you my advice. Next time Caleb tells you that it's over, there are two, not one, but two words you need to say to him. Oh, here we go again. Okay, Jack, I'm ready. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Great. It was very, uh, uh, let's see. It was, uh, it was great. Great's a word. Come on, am I or am I not just what you're looking for in your new steamy red hot band? Well, I think I could probably get used to playing with you. So, does that mean I pass the audition? It might. I'd like to, uh, I'd like to see you work on your technique a little bit. But, mm -hmm. uh, I'd have to say, well, you'd definitely be on your way to, uh, to great, great things. I'll haunt you wherever you go, Caleb. I'll never leave you alone. You can never get rid of me. Ever. What's wrong? Hey, 
Hey, look what we have here. Young man, come to me. Danny boy, how are you? Hey, you I, I have very good. strict instructions from, mm. from Christina because mm. they're playing school and she wants him back at his desk before he's tardy. Oh, all right. You better behave yourself. You don't want to get thrown out of school like your dad. Mm -hmm. Come on, let, let me chat with you for a moment. Uh, you're going to be so busy playing, you won't even know I'm gone, will you? But while I'm away, while I'm away, Christina and Lucy are going to take care of you. All right? And in no time, you're going to be back in my arms. I love you, boy. I love you. Mm. I know. So you came down here again for me. <laughs> Baby, I put in a request to slap some sense into you the first day that you whipped up that mirage of me. But we've been backlogged. And actually, I'm not even supposed to be here right now. But I couldn't, I couldn't watch you make a mess of everything. Look, I'm trying, OK? Yeah, I know you are. And you're off to a really great start, bouncing out of that vampire band. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> the band, the band. Who needs to be on top of the charts anyway, right? You're the one who said you wanted a solo career, right? You wanted to be the star of your own show. Well, honey, this is it. Baby, you can do anything that you want to. Only weighing yourself down and tying your heart to the past. It's not the way to go. And I know you felt that all along. Yeah, I guess part of me always knew that I was making the offer. How am I supposed to do that, Casey? I, I love you so much, man. I would do anything to be with you. I even went as far as making you up out of thin air. Babe, there's got to be a way that we can be together. Yeah. Yeah, sure. Yeah, there's a way. All right, then, 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 then tell me. OK, it's simple, baby. Die. Finish it. Is that what you want? Is that what you really, really want? You see, you don't know a thing about my relationship, Chuck. Oh, no? <laughs> I know you're as addicted to Caleb as I once was to you, except I had sense enough to get out of it after being kicked in the teeth a few hundred times. See, no matter what we tell you, you would always... I know, I know, okay? Well, here's something you don't know. As long as Caleb has the name, he has the power, he controls the show. I get that. So what's your point? My point is, you have your own life. You have your own show. You need to start controlling it. You need to start running it. Now, we need to find you something else to do. Because yeah. I'm going over Caleb full mm -hmm. time. Sure. Like what, Jack? Like, maybe you should come with me tonight. Down by the river, there's a gallery opening, photo gallery, and it would be fun. You know, maybe you should just tag along. Tag? So it wouldn't be a date or anything, right? You can call it what you want. If you want it to be a date, which it kind of sounds like you do to be a date, uh -huh. you can do whatever you want. Or you can sit here and feel sorry for yourself and wait for Caleb. Good choice. It's time for you to start controlling your own life. Be your own person. So what's it going to be, Libby? Coming or not? Yes or no? Makes it a little easier. Don't he'll be okay when now. Don't. Please don't say it. It's like I told him. We're still together. We're, we're just not living in the same place. Ian, I would. We can't take a chance. Not with the children, you know. You're right. You're right. I will find a way out of this. I will. Trust me. Christina? 